What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another Peasant Cube Thank you. here on MagicTheGathering.com. For some reason. To Exodus. Thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Oh, that's not what we... Oh, fucking Christ. Yep, oh, now it's not moving. Cool. Yep, literally can't move this now. That's incredible. Solid program. It's absolutely professional product. And how about now? Nope, still cannot move this. Oh, now I can. Okay, anyway, we're focusing on picks here. We gotta take something here. We'll put a creature as a through left your hand or graveyard on the battlefield. Return to your hand if you make sense. Of. Okay, I think it's just Kazmina. I think Kazmina's really, really good. So. One damage each up to two dark creatures, transforms into 6 4. I'm going to take the Kazmina here. There's a lot of good cards in this pack. But, you know, I think I just want to counter the things. Okay, let me move this back to where it belongs. Bottom. Okay, we did it. I think. God, I hope. Okay, we're back. And Jester Sinister Sabotage is probably the correct pick after our Kazmina. We could also take Regal Bloodlord and try to be the uh, Black White Life Gain deck, which seems like it's a thing. Thank you. That actually seems kind of sweet. Snizzle Mood, thanks so much for the resub, buddy. Welcome back. I'm gonna. Uh, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to live that dream because that's sweet. And now we can take unmake, which is also pretty sweet. Murder of crows also good. Riffling cloudskate also good. Um, Bastion does not seem bad with Regal Bloodlord. Smiting Helix also decent, but I'm not sure our odds of actually flashing it back. Could still be good even without that. Let's yeah, I'm gonna take it. If we have any way to splash that, it's pretty good. Maybe you're up you draw a card unless the time opponent's target for creature. Oh, okay, sorry. <coughs> thank you. Excuse me, thank you. Anonymous Red, thank you so much for the reset. Welcome back. You know what else doesn't move? My Prime subscription to Frank Malarkey. Hope you're having an awesome... Hey, you too, buddy. You too. Also, like, Seeker. Let's go to the Bloodlord. Is this card any good? I don't even know, man. Trip was good. Trip was good. I'm gonna take this guy. It's a five four. It's a five three flyer. Oh, gifted Aetherborn. You're not bad. I'll take you. Also, pristine talisman. I'm a big fan of pristine talisman, especially because it ramps us to Bloodlord and gains us life in return. I'm gonna take the talisman instead. Ooh, whatever you gain life, put a one on counter. See, this is the these are the cards that we want for this deck. Two one with afterlife two. That's kind of sweet. Migratory route. Create four 1-1 one, one white bird tokens with flying. That actually seems fantastic. That's a really sweet card. Is last night's draft? Yeah, it went up. It, the one went up. One went up. Uh, one went up today at uh, 11 a.m. Eastern. The other one's going to go up at 9 p.m. Eastern. So maybe, depending on which one you're looking for. Much better than Remedial Aetherborn. That's true. That's a truth. Yeah, the first one's definitely up.
Well, nothing for us here. Although, if we are splashing red, we can take a Rough Rider or Swift War Kite. I don't know if we're going to be red yet, but we'll see. Peace Strider gains his life. Not terrible. Sandstep Citadel? Not bad. That's two of our three colors. Two of our two colors. That's what I meant. Do, 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 do. Did you guys see this guy yet? Mangara, the Diplomat. Four mana for a legendary human cleric for a 2-4 with lifelink. Whenever an opponent attacks with creatures, if two or more of those creatures are attacking you and or planeswalkers you control, draw a card. Whenever an opponent casts their second spell each turn, draw a card. That guy is going to let you draw lots of cards. Oh, interesting. Why does it say whenever an opponent attacks, if two or more of those creatures are attacking you and or planeswalkers you control? Why does it say when, when why does it say when they attack with creatures? Daxos not bad for the life gain deck. Guantanamera. You can attack with floating mana as if it were a creature. God damn. Okay, Lingering Souls is nice. Angel of Despair might come back. This card's also fantastic. I'm going to take Lingering Souls. Lingering Souls is just too good, especially when we're like trying to blood artist them. Uh, excuse me. Oh yeah, that's not bad either. Making tokens. Definitely don't want things like Drown in Sorrow because that's scary. Probably just this, yeah. I'm okay with it. Uh, we did get a house, yes. I don't know if it was the same house we were looking at because we looked at like 10 houses, but we definitely got a place. So that's nice. I like having a place to live. What part of Denver? Uh, we're going to be in Aurora. It's a lot of three drops, but that's okay. Hey, that's okay. Hmm. Kong Ming is decent. That's a nice little general. Uh, are they called generals? No, they're called... Fuck, I can't think of the name. Lords. It's a nice little lord. Also, Honden is decent in our deck because gaining two a turn triggers this 
and this. When am I? When am I moving? Next week, next Friday. Um, I think it's Kong Ming. We have a lot of tokens right now. Whenever you gain life, put a one on counter on it. Yeah, let's do that. Any card that's gonna reference my life gain, I'm okay with. Anything good here? Pillory's nice. Pillory's real nice. Oh, but Lone Rider's nice too. That's actually tricky. You know, I have a feeling in June they're not going to be very icy. Plus, I've made the trip twice and it's just fine. Yeah, I think Pillory's better. Maybe the Lone Rider comes back. I have no idea. Everything you got. Oh, Basilica Bell Haunt. That card's banging. Are there two drops in this cube that I can take? You just passed a Lone Rider. What more do you want? You know, is that you're going to be a guy in the chat? Look at all this life gain. So good. It's a Lone Rider. It's true, I do have a Daxos. Oh, Nyx Fleece Ram? Oh, baby. Oh, yeah, we're Nyx Fleecing it up. Our deck's looking sweet, man. I would love some more fixing lands. I wish this was a... Hold on. I know it. I can, I can, I can think of it. Uh, it's not Sands of Citadel because it's this one. I can't think of it. Fuck. Makes me sad. Nomad Outpost. I gotta ruin it. Dang it. So close. Uh, I saw a creature put four greater. Or we can just play God's Willing. God's Willing is pretty good. I think God's Willing is probably better. We have this, we have Pillory, Unmake, Smiting Helix. Inner Demon came back? Wow, this card is bonkers. This card won Rob and I a lot of uh, Thank you. a lot of battle bonds. Adam, thanks so much for the resub, buddy. Welcome back, my dude. Rock Reinforcements is great. I'm gonna take the Bloodfell Caves just in case you wanna play uh, the second half of Smiting Helix. Or this Swift War Kite. I doubt it, but why not? We got a lot of three drops, right? Not really. Aerialist and Ministrant. Um, yeah, okay. No one wants to hear about Battle Bondage with Rob. Oh, wow. Casual, uh, casual 25 gifted subs. Totally, totally reasonable Thank thing you. to do. Totally reasonable. Adam, man, thank you, dude. <laughs> that's, that's <coughs> well, that's ridiculous. That's going to take some time. Dude, you're awesome, man. Oh, my God. Thank you. Um. Well, if you guys didn't know, me and Rob did an episode of Freshly Brewed. You can check it out here for thank now. You. And hopefully we'll be getting it distributed through the other... Uh, the other podcast sites so definitely Thank check you. that out and um we are going to talk about spoilers there we'll also probably do our set review on magic online Thank you. or on on twitch rather i would imagine so me and rob are going to do freshly brewed because me and ollie just couldn't get it to work so uh Thank it's you. either incremental blight or swords i think adam man thank you so much dude that is ridiculous man they're just gonna keep on going thank you just gonna keep on going no one wants to hear about personally bondage. You know what, John? You know what, buddy? Thank you. Yes, they do. 
And Current of Light's amazing, but Swords is also amazing. I think we're taking Swords and... Thank you! I'm just gonna keep on rolling. Ooh, Scarab Barons is actually just better than Arcane Sanctum in our deck. Thank you! Bile Blight's pretty good, too. I bet one of these comes back and we can take the Bile Blight. That's gonna be my guess. Healer's Thank Hawk, also you. pretty cute for this deck. Oh my god. These, these, these subs, Adam. Dude, you're awesome. We still got like, still got like ten more to go. Thank you. Probably just Knight's Whisper here. Card advantage is nice in this format. Thank you. John, this is a peasant cube, so it's only commons and uncommons. Void Beckoner. Oh, Thank this is you. just the one from uh, Ikoria, huh? Each creature you control that one encounter has life link. Thank you. You know what? I'll put you over here. You you fit the theme, so that's good enough, right? Thank you. After a while, the thank yous just start to sound like sneezes. Yeah, that sounds about right. That checks out. I want to take meteor. Oh, actually, hold thank on. Thank you. There's battlefield. It just lightning helix or something. That seems pretty good. Meteor golem seems, just seems great though, right? Thank you. Abolish. Meh. Eh. Thank you. It might just be Demir Aqueduct, just because the mana is so efficient. Azorius Signet, also not terrible. Oh my god, there's so many you. I'll take Demir Aqueduct. The only other option is like Necrogen Scudder. I could actually see myself playing this too, so Thank that's you. good. Uh, you're alright. Soul Snuffers? Thank you. Meh. Freebooter? I guess you're fine. I think our deck is done. I just want to have one of them lands come back. Lich's Mastery Historic deck. I haven't actually played any Historic, but because of the cards they've been adding, um... I kind of wouldn't mind. That'd be... I'd be okay with that. Oh, Sarah? I think Sarah's just great. Like, even in the cube, it's still just like... You still just gotta deal with it, man. Takes everything you got. Wouldn't you like to get away? What, do I have cheers in my head? Did someone do this? I cannot believe you've done this. Sometimes you wanna go. Ribbons of Night. Oh man, we have Demir Aqueduct too. I'll take our ribbons. Well, now we have 25. I think Peace Strider's pretty mediocre despite his life gain. Ribbons, we can cast off Aqueduct. Aqueduct. When there's trouble, you can call DW. Aqueduct. That's a little Darkwing Duck to the tune of Aqueduct. And, uh... It's the best I got, guys. It's the quality good content you're here for right now. It is no f nothing. What is forfeit? Yeah, scoured barons, boy. What is four fat chickens, though, you know? We only have, like, two fixing lands, unfortunately. Demir Aqueduct doesn't really fix anything. It just lets us ribbons of night. <coughs> Affinity, you are never not here, which is just wonderful. This dude bopped us yesterday. I'm just going to take it so no one else can have it. We have 12 creatures. We also have Lingering Souls, which is creatures. Start, which is creatures. So that's like 14 creatures. This makes a 1-1. One, one. 
It's like 15 creatures. Disco Elysium, I really enjoyed, but it was a little out there. It was a little too much. For one thing, I hate reading in games. Uh, it just take it kind of takes me out of it. Like, it's not immersive for me. I don't feel like I'm in the world. I feel like I'm reading about the world. It's really, it's interesting. Plus, like, I think the game was just a little too abstract. But, that being said, I hope you enjoy it. Because it is, like, well-reviewed, right? Like, it's got very good reviews, so... What does people leave? What is that? Is that a is that an emote that didn't work? An RPG where you play as a shark? God, you're talking my language. Oh, we kind of want the red just for this, right? Like we kind of just want Bloodfell Caves just in case. We need to cut one card. Or we don't. What do you think about that? So this is six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This is six, seven, eight. Now we have seven, eight, nine, five, six, seven, eight, nine. This is a nine, nine. Sure. We can get one more. Let's get one more. Another white. Let's do a white. 41. We're doing it. Where does Peepo leave, though? I don't know what that is. I want to see that. I want to see the emote. <whistles> Snap it off. When there's trouble, you can call Smokey Loki. Darkwing Dick. Something like that. Nexus and Winota in Historic. God, you're talking about all the wrong words. <whistles> Let's get dangerous. So after Yellowstone erupts in June, the alien everyone discovered in August. Right after Earth gets hit by a solar Thank flare in you. July. Yeah, that sounds about right. Dealy, thank you so much for the resub, buddy. Welcome back. <sighs> oh, that guy's that guy's leveling. Always yield to that. I don't need to be. Bazorpals, my dude. Let's see if they want to daze this. They did not. Discarding momentary blink, that's full value. Ooh, they didn't do anything? I got you. Oh, I like that. Let's do a little bopping. So...
Let's flash them dudes back. Are you gonna supreme will my thing? Play this and bounce this. I mean, that seems fine. Supreme will for half a lingering souls. <clears throat> it's good times. That card's very good. Mm -hmm, cheer you up. Whoa, here she comes. There's a man eater. Oh, that's fascinating. One, two, three, four, five. So we can actually go one, two, three. Use the blue. One, two, three. Play this lady. Watch out, boy, she'll chew you up. Next turn, this gets two 1 1 counters, and we can also keep up God's Willing. God's Willing, we should be able to protect it. I'm going to watch this man eater trailer. Humans kill 100 million sharks every year. But only five humans are. Is that true? Humans kill 100 million sharks every year? That doesn't seem accurate. That statistic sounds false. <clears throat> we sh you guys should play that game and sing the song. Watch out, boy, she'll chew you up. Whoa, here she comes. There's a man eater. What are the odds this thing's dead? Very high. Oh, not so high. Okay. Well. Oh, here she comes. Oh, man, it just keeps getting better. Yep. Let's get in there with this bloodthirsty aerialist that's going to win us this game. Single-handedly. Watch out, but now I have manager stuck in my head. You guys are monsters. What is this? This actually seems fine, I think. It's annoying, but like. Katie, my love, how are you? I ordered Luigi's Mansion. <laughs> I think this is okay. Like, it's annoying for sure, but... Whoa, here she comes. One, two, three. Ariales. This is a sorcery. One, uh, two, three. Sacrifice a creature? Easily one of these guys. Get him. 
Getting ready for our Denver debut. <laughs> It's true. All right, I hope it's not. I hope it's nothing good. I hope it's a crappy card. <clears throat> oh, it's an oblivion ring. See, this is why we want to save the the gods willing. Yep, doesn't, never fucking matters. Absolutely never matters. Well, maybe matters, I guess. It's just infuriating. One time. Okay, I'm gonna name White. Don't want that. That was a good. That was a good scry. He got mad. He was getting upset. But it's okay. Here comes Journey into Nowhere. No, I can hit Journey. Can they bounce it again? Are they just gonna bounce it again? <laughs> I don't know what's happening right now. Oh, there's leveling up in that cute. Okay. Well, this is a 5 6 again on our turn, so that's pretty good. Can I, can I do get a Ribbons of Night? Pff, meteor Column ain't too shabby. One, two, three, five, six, seven. Let's get in there. Whoa, here she comes. Katie, did you look into Render's Insurance yet, my dear? I want to get this taken care of. Everything else is taken care of. We got the water, the electricity, the trash, the internet. Are there any rats? Not not dedicated rats. There's cards like negative two, negative two. I mean, everything that's uncommon is pretty much fair game. Well, man, this is just this card is just bonkers. Just want to say thanks for the content. Really enjoyable watching you stream to stream. I appreciate you too, Exodus. No, my head hurts. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Well, um, we're getting Xfinity because it's the only uh, it's the only option really. Abolish isn't bad. They have shown us enchantments and things. She's a man-eater. Sometimes your head just hurts. That's true. It's true. It's true. It's true. Yep. I have never lived in a place that could have fiber. When I lived in St. Pete, I was out of range of, of fiber. When I lived in Clearwater, I was out of range of fiber. When I lived in Seattle, I was out of range of fiber. Here in Utah, we don't have fiber. In Aurora, Colorado, we won't have fiber. I've never lived in a place that had fiber in that area. It's wild. Absolutely wild. Backwards Utah. I don't know if that's true. <clears throat> Okay, okay. So next turn we can play Ministrant. We'd like a Swamp. I'll take a Demir Aqueduct as well. Plains is not what we're looking for, unfortunately, but uh, I appreciate the... Interesting. Double Vision. Five mana for a red enchantment, so you know it's going to be a weird one. Whenever you cast your first instant or sorcery spell each turn, copy that spell. You may, that seems really good for five mana. So 
So the only thing we can really do here is go one, two, three, pristine into mixed fleece. Sure. Spell fires. You'll get caught up in the spell fire. Well, now we're getting to a turn, which is pretty sweet. So we're basically canceling out that dude. I need to go bring my car to get a <clears throat> an oil change tomorrow. Need in the swamp. Wow, fucking Elite Guard Ranch and Cloud Blazer. Jesus. Rich get richer. Man, can you imagine if we draw Regal Bell Haunt? Regal, no, not that's this is Bell Haunt. Regal Bloodlord, is that what it's called? The vampire that gives you a bat every time you gain life, and we just get two bats a turn. Good lord, man. Uh, I'm at 24 life, thank you very much. Unbelievable. I will take four. They have four cards in hand. That's pretty good. Hey, that's pretty good. What in the earth? Oh, that's real good. Don't like that. Would you like to waste this mana? Okay. Hold on, I gotta fix something real quick. You. Magic Bell Wine. This one. Clues. Okay. No, don't like that. Oh, ling lingrinos. Oh my god, I totally forgot I had an article go up today. Wow, it's been a busy morning. Did you ever know that you had spirits? Everything I would like to be. Antibody, thank you for your two months, buddy. I appreciate you. Howdy, Moochel. Oh, it's... <laughs> I was like, I was like, Superfits, he's not even here. What are you talking about? And I was like, oh, he's in the chat. I was wondering, you're, you're singling out one token? Sure. Man, they have a lot of the, the blue-white cards, the good blue-white stuff. What up, Mind Bomber? I mean, the peasant cube is a cube, right? So, I like it in that sense. Also, legacy cube is coming up too. And I'm hoping I don't miss too many days because of move. All right. 
Alrighty then. Give me that life. Give me that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Dang it. Oh, biscuits. I do kind of want to just kill this because I think it's relevant. I think it's one of the things keeping them in this game. I don't get to draw a card, but that's okay. If one of their cards is like Supreme Will, I guess that's fine. I don't know. And it is. It always fucking is. <laughs> I mean, you could have asked me a question then, too. I was literally thinking that. I'm like, can we God's willing this and give it pro blue? No. Well, the problem is, like, the companion role is already... It, like, it kind of already does that, right? Like... I mean, most of the... I don't know. Like, I guess Luris decks don't... Yeah. No, because I don't think a lot of the offenders really have a problem with that. Like, the Obosh deck didn't... I guess it was... I don't know. It's a good question. Because the Obosh deck was definitely, like, green-red, and it doesn't have green in it, obviously. And the Orion decks have, like, blue and red, and they're green and red in them. I think that just makes them too... I think that just makes them... Too narrow. Maybe? I don't even know. I just want to land so I can Meteor Golem this, this Enclave Cryptologist because... It's really gonna... Make me sad. I'm kind of hoping the cubes would stop for a while. I've been like a week behind on YouTube vids. <laughs> oh, man. There's one standard video I put up. Wait, really? This is interesting. I think we just take two here because if we block with all three, then this Cloud Goat Ranger starts doing us dirty, so. It would have been nice if we could add a hand in instant speed. Yeah, it would have been nice, but I think it also would have been really powerful. Uh, the bands were live on MTG on like Monday, I think, yeah. Come on, Daxos. That's. Not exactly what we're looking for, but... Well, butter my biscuits. Oh man, look at this. Abolish doing some work now. Okay, we really have to get rid of Enclave Cryptologist. Really? The updated bands on Arena were supposed to go in live today, so. Yeah, I'm definitely tripping, triple blocking Cloud Goat here. I mean, which is good for them, because now it leaves them free to attack with either of these. Triggers. This game has been kind of grindy. Is this where they resurrect Cloud Goat? No, nope, just prismatic. Prophetic prism. Gas Chamber, I literally thought that your your comment was Nick's Fleece Ram related. If you have a sheep that's going to die, you shear it first. I was like, okay, but what are you saying right now? Damn! 
Thank you. Alan, 61 months, dude? 61 is a lot. No joke, man. <sighs> I'll let them gain two first. You're everything I would like to be. Yeah, just take that three. Because I want to keep up God's willing. We only have two white left. So thankfully we got rid of their stupid idiot. Sixty-one months is like eighteen years. That's basically sixty. That's basically like four thousand. The problem with not killing Honden is we just have, it just gives them so much time. We we can't race them ever. And the only other target we saw is Oblivion Ring. Would you have a God's willing for? Oh well, I'm probably gonna God's willing for that. We take him a bell haunt. Taking Daxos, huh? I'm a God's willing Daxos for that. That seems fine. Blue. Oh, yeah, we don't have to keep that. Get rid of it. Does let us play Meteor Golem, but I'd rather just draw a land naturally than, than to force myself to have another one. Because if there's two lands in a row, I definitely don't want two lands in a row. Um, yep. So much life, man. Oh, come on. Yep, that's why we didn't keep that planes. Do you mind if I do a tiny amount of self-advertisement? Buddy, not even a little bit, man. I appreciate you asking, Alan, but that's just silly. Oh, Christ. Yep, that's pretty good. Well, that's hard to deal with. <laughs> it's, it's a trap. <laughs> oh, we have a good time. Yep, that's... I don't think we can actually beat that. Oh boy. So if we try to kill this, they exile itself. If we try to kill this. Okay. Um. We kill the two, three. Thank you. Wow, it's sad because we have this guy which gains us two bats a turn, but it's too late because they drew Miss Meadow Witch, which is really fucking hard to deal with. Yeah, their deck is insane. Anything we target, they blink. Like, it's not even, I don't think it's even worth playing it out. They're gaining two life a turn. Like, we just don't have pressure for that. They can just eat everything we have. Oh, it's not each turn. Yeah, it's not each time you gain life. It's at the it's beginning of each end step. 
Yeah, I mean, well, we could we could use Nyx Fleece Realm on our turn, um, Prismatic Beast, Prismatic, Pristine Talisman on their turn, but yeah, it's just one a turn, unfortunately. I thought it was better than it was. It's still very good. Uh, deck does look sweet. I agree with you. Unfortunately, our opponent's deck is also very, very good. Daily Coker with the gifted subs, buddy. Oh, man. I appreciate you, my dude. Thank you. That is awesome. Thank you, man. That is ridiculous. Thank you. Call the foot doctor. I'll fix your pain. Dodge. Never luck. You already subbed, man. Thank you. Good gravy. Thank you. Thank you. Katie, my love, welcome back. Thank you. Well, I was hoping for a two drop, but we don't have that many, so. You think they're going to counter my lingering souls? No. Nope. Thank you. Okay, that guy's fine. Uh, Quicksand is Thank definitely you. not worth playing, no. Uh, for one thing, most of the threats that I care about are, are flyers, and for two, our mana restrictions are Thank you. way too high for a for a colorless land. Double black is nice though. Oh, Kong Ming Thank seems you. great with some spirits, some spurts. Okay, that thing is my least favorite thing. I don't like it at all. You might say, I hate it. Can attack or block as... Oh God, like, now this is even worse because, like, they just blink it. I hate it! Alright, we'll just linger here. We'll play Bloodfell Caves. And next turn we'll Kong Ming. Now we're just going to hope to race with 8 power on board next turn. Calling my doctor to fix your pains. What are the odds? <sighs> it's 
high, right? It's got to be 400%. We don't have any way to gain life. Oh, uh, yeah, sure, you can chat M21 spoilers and predictions. Like, we know they have a counter spell, right? We kind of have to force them into it, right? So, whatever. Mmm! Oh, biscuits. Cool. <sighs> Fucking amazing. That was fun. Yep. I had a good time. Yeah, I don't know if that instant speed Teferi is real or not. Kind of hoping it's not because it seems pretty unbeatable. Like, they just go end of turn Teferi, untap, and then they can protect it forever. So, that's that's cool. Ideally, we can draw a white source next turn. Got it. That's a cool looking fish. I'm actually tempted to swords it, but I don't think that's good. See, that's better. I'm just gonna hold this guy back. I think it's just better on the board. Oh, we just win the game. So sometimes when you play Kong Ming with four spirits out, you just win the game. Other times your opponents play Aether Eyes and also have a uh, Mist Shit Weaver thing. Whatever the thing's called, I have no idea. What is this new background? I don't like you getting electrocuted. <laughs> What is this background, actually? Um, hold on, I can find out real quick. I can find out real quick. Uh, let's go to overlay. This is uh the th This is the new through the breach. Yeah, I'll keep this hand. 
Katie, if you can find me a better a better background, I would love I would love to use it, my dear. I tried it because obviously I'm using the left and the bottom of the art. So if anyone has art that's big, like like twelve eighty by by seven twenty at least, uh, probably bigger than that. Uh, if you can find magic art like that that has action that looks that looks good on the on the left, on the left side and the bottom, then I am okay with that. How about a beach or a sunny forest? Okay, so you literally just want sunny things because that's your happy place. All right, let's play Nixie, Nixie Boy because otherwise we're going to have to discard. Are they countering my Nix Fleece Ram? No, they're cycling Oketra's Attendant. It's actually pretty good. <whistles> See, as long as I have things to do, I'm okay with just playing the things in my hand already. I see nothing wrong with that. That's true. There's nothing wrong with that. Should I just use a real life picture instead of a magic online art? What's the date today? Today is the 4th, so I'm going to the 5th. Wait, what? Today is Thursday? Why does it feel like Wednesday? Oh god, I think I'm having a stroke. This feels very strange. I, my article went up yesterday and I didn't even realize that. I totally forgot. Because I just went to schedule my oil change and I'm like, oh, I'll just get it done tomorrow, Thursday. Holy crap, it's Thursday? I'm actually legitimately freaked out right now. Why did I think it was Thursday? Or Wednesday? Oh, fuck. I can't. Well, I'm going to schedule my car for tomorrow at 11. Oh, good, they got rid of my Kong Ming. Oh, little Kong Ming. Um, actually, maybe we just play this big, fat, indulgent Tormentor. Let's do that. Sold my turnips for a tiny 2 million bell profit. Wow, that's pretty good. I don't know much about... I don't know much about Animal Crossing, but that's pretty good. My nine-year-old son has been talking to me about how he has to check the price of turnips because if the price is up, he will sell them. He also has been making tons of money selling sh selling sharks. I haven't gotten any sharks yet, but I haven't been able to play lately because I work 36 hours a day. All of this is accurate. Whoa, here he comes. I, oh my god, tomorrow's fucking Friday already. That's wild, dude.
to sharks and fish tanks? No way, man. You gotta let them sharks f float free. Float free. A little agony warp in the, agony warp in the graveyard. That could have killed this. Inner demon. That nah, couldn't have done it. Okay, you got a three three. Watch out, boy! He'll chew you up. Who's a man eater? Can we talk about man eaters? Yeah, we move in literally a week. I'm I'm super like, wow! I can't believe it's Thursday already. Where did this week go? I am just flabbergasted right now. What'd they do? Where'd they, what'd they get rid of? Oh, they just took three? Well, it's basically the same as this guy attacking, right? M21 have multiple types of creatures. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, that is a hot take. I said, damn, what a hot take. Ugh. That's the hottest take I've ever heard. Did my resub not ping? Rallus, I did not see it. But I do see subs, so I appreciate you, my dude. Wow, they traded Merfolk Looter for an Indulgent Tormentor? Good deal. Good deal, everyone. I mean, I'm just going to play Sarah Angel here, right? Like, come on. They're going to counter it. That's life. Oh, come on with these count. How many fucking Supreme Wills am I going to see in this just this one draft? Jesus. That's frustrating. <laughs> this is the art that was suggested in the chat. Unfortunately, the friggin' loot tree wouldn't even be visible. You'd just see this side and this side. But the thing is, like, the colors look good, right? So, like, this is actually a decent option. It also is at a beach, that's true. Oh, is this guy coming in? Oh, look, another elite guard. Is this just the same deck? Oh, no, you're right. I'm not saying, I'm not saying it's not an option. I just wanted to make sure you guys knew. You know what I mean? Watch out, boys, and chew you up. Whoa, here she comes. You gonna counter my Daxos? I'll counter that, though. <laughs> That's how my opponent sounds right now. Yep. Here we go. Oh, you're just destroying my enchantment? Weird. Get in there. The Moochels burp. Wow. Smokey Loki, I really appreciate that you support so many streamers. Oh, I see. Well, see you later. <laughs> so Katie just sent me this. This is the art she wants me to use. Again, like, I mean, actually, it's not bad. You get this shark fin. If you guys can find a big version of the crust crustacean art, then, uh... Was it just a 3-3? Okay. I'll take it. Give me a land so I can play Meteor Golem. On your Banishing Light. Give me my Kong Ming back. Alright, we're doing it.
Oh, wow, they're just conceding there? Really? I don't know if that was conceitable, but... Inconceitable! Still pretty good. Alright, well. Check out Brokos Regular. Can you link me to it, my dude? I would love to see a Brokos Regular. That's, that's the most not relaxing beach ever. Yeah, this is a beach with a thunderstorm. <laughs> where you're like, oh god, things are happening. Why is the crab crying? Is it crying? Oh, because it's a cry station. <laughs> oh, Jesus. What are the crab for? Buddy, you got me. I like when you hover over the Brokos, it turns into this horrifying Brokos. And you're like, oh, Jesus. I'll keep this even though we have no white... And we're going to have to discard if we play Demir Aqueduct on turn two. So basically, perfect hand. I don't have a larger picture. Well, you know what, buddy? You're not helping me out here. I expected better antibody. Barocos. They just cycled that? Okay. Man, a white mana. I would, I would just be so grateful right now. I think I actually have to play this. Bounce you. And then we got to discard something. Probably Daxos at this point. Are you there, Michael? Hey, Michael. It's Margaret. Are you there? Okay, it's fine. So this is three blue-white decks in a row, just to be clear. Also, if you guys haven't done so, definitely check out ManaTraders.com. They have an amazing subscription service. I utilize them myself. And you can get 20% off your first three months with the promo code RATTRAIN. So use, use the promo code RATTRAIN, along with the link down below in the description. And uh, you'll get 20% off the first three months at ManaTraders.com. They have awesome service. A ton of my viewers use them. And uh, it's a big help to me as well. Kazmina. I'm a big Kazmina fan. The promo code is legit rat train. Yeah, I try I train I, I emailed them and we changed it to rat train. White source. Oh, that's okay. Spells and runs against water. I guess we can just I guess we can just hit hit at Kazmina. So now she's kind of useless. Well, that's pretty good. Oh, boy. If you're talking dote sodes, hey, that's pretty good. Hmm. Yeah, I think we want to get the Kazmina off the board.
Cause me da, cause me da. Me when you talk like that. Okay, now we're just gonna hope they don't have God's willing. That would be actual the worst. Well, that was cool. Sammy, I have no idea, dude. Yep, all right, fuck this. Actual horse shit. Cool. Hey, God's willing is the actual worst. Just kidding. Yep. <laughs> that is a less relaxing beach. Oh, definitely keeping this. Ship on you. Done. I mean, cube's going fine, I guess. I don't know. We're 2 1 1 2, and then we're 1 1 in this draft, so. Look, I'm demulliganing here. I think we're just going to try to pick up every card that is a two for one. <laughs> if it's a two for one, I'll take it. That looks not peaceful at all. <laughs> Katie, I don't know if Magic has very many peaceful beaches, I'll be honest with you. But I am more than willing to, to make one my background if that if you can find one that, that works. That plane isn't really a beach, though. I roll. My name is Ma <clears throat> Oh god, it it was not it didn't go well. <clears throat> My name is Maximus Decimus Meridius, husband to a murdered wife, father to a murdered son, and I will have my revenge in this life or the next. I feel like we've drawn the same four cards every game. <laughs> it's one of them.
Oh, I like this one. Katie just sent me this one. I, this looks like a land. What land is this, my love? I don't think we're winning this game anymore. I think we're one twoing this draft, so that's that's unfortunate. Every time I feel like my deck is great and I have a really sweet deck, I have a lot of synergies. I never draw any of the fucking cards that actually beat four one one flyers or aetherize your four one one fly. Like if I have four one one flyers, my opponent has aetherize. If I have nothing, my opponent has four one one flyers. I'm just like, okay, you got it. I mean that's life, I guess. I'm googling flooded strand art. Oh, here's a big version of that. Oh, that's nice. Oh, let's try that. All right. I'll do that today. Well, this dude's just dead. See, that card I can deal with. It's funny because Katie's a... Katie's a, a, a blue-white and I'm a blue-black. I'm a blue -black, So... Guess I'll take five. What about this flooded strand? Well, I gotta save it as dot JPEG. I love it when you save them as JPEGs and then they get darker because you can't actually save them on the thing. That's nice. Barcode, thanks so much for the resub, buddy. Welcome back. A substantial commitment. I see what you did there. I see what you did there. Alright. Time to deal two damage. And gain two life. I worked at a movie rental place when that came out on VHS DVD. What when what came out? I totally forgot what we were talking about. Uh, it was on the demo video that played over and over all day long at work. Also had beautiful stranger by Madonna, who let the dogs out, Chicken Run trailer, and Mission Impossible Two trailer among others. It was about a twenty to thirty minute tape demo. My shift was nine hours, so you're like, well, only seven more times to hear this. I like that you can actually tell how much how much longer your shift is by uh by how many more how many times you've heard that you're like well i've heard it six times today it's so only five more hours okay this is good yep i'm tempted to god's willing here just because i don't want to replay this guy next turn i do have a meteor golem so Uh, let's keep that on the top. Keep on top. Alright, so we're not dead. Do we just kill a bird? It seems real bad. I still think it's necessary, awkwardly enough. Well, this place I want to get my oil changed just said we are booked until next Wednesday the 10th. So that's cool. That's cool. Having a good time. Having a good time. Alright, we'll try somewhere else. Oh, God. I 
Yeah, these have been. Have you been watching Shaun of the Dead? I don't think I've ever seen Shaun of the Dead. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Not sure what I could draw here that would actually do anything. Thank you. Yeah, I just have no desire to change my own oil. I don't have any of the things required for it. I don't have a way to lift my car. Uh, it's also a Prius, so I don't really want to have to get under there and do all the Prius work. I understand that changing oil is pretty rudimentary when it comes to cars, but I just have no desire to do it. Um, I could get a change on Wednesday. I just have no, I don't really want to, though, because I already have the maintenance required light on, and I've gotten two warning lights, which is I've never seen before. So I'm pretty sure uh, my oil is at the lowest it's ever been. Block here, we take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, my main the the maintenance required light is what comes on. It's it's for it's what happens when the, when I need an oil change. So go block block block. We take four. Next turn we can meteor golem the the control magic. These are my biggest concerns. <laughs> well, the maintenance required light is usually not a huge deal, but the fact that it's uh, the the tri the red triangle also comes up and says it says problem. That's where the big deal comes in. And that's where, that's the thing is, that's never happened before. So I'm pretty sure my oil is as low as it's ever been. Yeah, I could just top it off, but I'd rather just get it done, so. Sure. I don't know how we get out of this. Yep, every fucking game. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Make sure you share my fucking misery with me because this draft was miserable considering how good I thought our deck was. That's magic though, so it happens. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check out patreon.com slash franklaportmanitraders.com. Cool stuff, Inc. every Wednesday. I had an article go up yesterday. And twitch.tv slash franklaport for watching on YouTube. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next time.